Hello, I'm Emily and this is the fourth day of Morse code for Grovers. And last time we left off with some with some words. So I will go over those again and we'll see if you got them. All right, so here's the words again. So if you want to practice right now, you can pause it and see if you get them right. Otherwise, I'll answer them now. All right, so this first one is P A I L for pale. And then next we have F L O P flop. Um, and then this last one, a little bit longer, this one is L E M O N for lemon. So if you got those amazing, um, otherwise we're going to go right into the next set of letters. Alright, here are the previous letters that we've learned, so if you haven't looked at those, uh, you can pause now and uh, take a note of these. So next we're going to learn Q, and this one I think is a little harder to remember, but it's dash dash dot dash, and there isn't a super fancy picture for this one. But I think, when I think of Q, I think of Queen, so I just turn these into a crown. Um, next we have R, and it's dot dash dot, and this one we turn into a radio. So if we draw it out and then draw a box around it, maybe some antenna, a radio. Next we have S and it is three dots and I like to think these three dots are little snails. Um, next we have T and this one's pretty simple just like E but opposite. It's uh, it's just one dash. And I like to remember this because it is like a top hat. Just add little lines up there. Next we have U. And it is two dots and then a dash. And then this one, if we move this line up here a little, it looks like a unicorn. That's, that's an odd unicorn, but... Yeah, maybe you'll be able to draw it better. <laughs> and then lastly we have V, and this one is three dots and then one line. And this one looks like three little Cheerios or something on the ground, and then this line reminds me of a vacuum trying to clean up the mess. So those are the letters for today. And just like last time, I will leave you with a few words um, so you can practice a little. Here are the words that I will give you today, and you can practice with these. Um, try to get them without notes, but if you have to, that's alright too. Um, I will give you the answer in the beginning of my next, uh, my next Grover video. Thanks for watching!